Welcome back. Would you eat meat you knew had been grown in a lab? Well, consumers will have that option in the very near future. The USDA has approved the production and sale of so-called cultivated chicken in the United States. Now, we are learning tonight more about how it's actually made and where it could be available. Meat without the slaughter. Two companies, Good Meat and Upside Foods, now have the green light to produce and sell their lab-grown chicken protein. We're just trying to make the same product people have loved their entire lives a different way. The meat is made from animal cells that are then grown in massive bioreactors, similar to those you'd find at a beer brewery. We can produce a lot of muscle tissue directly from a very small amount of cells, and then we feed it to other people. Supporters say it's a step forward in creating more cruelty-free food and a more environmentally friendly way to produce meat. Animal agriculture is responsible for a significant amount of greenhouse gas emissions, which contributes to climate change. Both the FDA and the USDA have said some lab meats are safe for human consumption, but experts caution, animal cells are prone to contamination and there are long-term production challenges. And you grow them at scale in such numbers that it will make it competitive with with beef or any other, you know, it could be fish or poultry. And our answer to that, based just on well-known principles of biotechnology or fermentation processes, it doesn't look very good. How much the lab-grown meat will cost is still unclear. While no exact launch date has been announced, Good Meat says it started production immediately after winning approval. The products are expected to be available first in select restaurants with the goal of eventually reaching supermarkets. So we've posted a poll online to see how people feel about this. Now, so far, only a few dozen responses, but the vast majority saying they are definitely not yeah. into the idea of lab-grown meat. But, what do you but, think? But the, the, the story, it, it certainly comes up with some positive reasons some, why. Yes. I don't know that I'm on board yet with it, though. It's what about funny. you? Well, I was thinking about it. You know, we probably do eat a couple of things that are closer to a lab experiment than <laughs> to the produce aisle. This is true. I mean, what exactly is cheese whiz? This you know? Good point. <laughs> like that. It's so good. But this is going to take a while to get. I do think it, we're going to have to call it something other than lab-grown meat. I know. That is not appetizing. That's not so working. Yeah. <laughs> Branding right. problem.